Hello! Well, people who are watching, I know this is unusual, but I'm kind of feeling like doing something a bit different from the RTS cast, so I figure I'll do FTL streams because... Well, actually, it, it's been requested, and I thought, well, why not? I'm not... I don't do things because of requests, but they do give me ideas for if I want to change things up slightly. I don't expect to be doing this on a regular basis, but then again, I have done odd things like this before, usually for seasonal things like Halloween. Anyway, so might as well just get started then. So I haven't actually played this game as much as a lot of people who stream it, so this is kind of... It is Advanced Edition, I do have all this stuff set up, and because I'm a total masochist, I will do it on hard, because... As has been shown in my previous Let's Die Horribly's, I tend to go for the hardest settings because that's just what you do. At least what I do. And I think we'll go with the Taurus as well. I quite like the way the Iron Blast stuff works. Let us start. Let us die horribly. In space. No, not much so far. Of course, nothing happens in the first sector. At least, Phil said nothing happens in the first sector. <laughs> Monkuki points out, I am going to die. Indeed, I am going to die. That is what I do. I die. But I shall die in style. And... I oh, can't really do much for you guys. I apologize. Asteroid Colony will have to do without. I will not be going over what's going on as I visit each location, except maybe to comment on the fact that it is something happening. So, yeah. You'll have to read. I'll leave it up for a little while for people to read. See, I will explore the asteroid field and get fuel. Well, at least that saves some time. I've been wasting time so far with jumps. Three useless jumps so far, but hey, finally, danger! We might die horribly. All right, well, naturally, got to start up. Throw Ion Blast on. Well, it'll hit their shields anyway. And the drone just does what it does, because drones don't like to behave. And hey, they have a combat drone too. Oh, nice, it's a laser drone. I actually have a chance around this. And turn off the weapons. Now I just need that drone to actually hit the... Oh, come on. Don't go for the weapons. Go for the engines. Go for the piloting. That's not good enough, drone. Ah. Of course, I gotta actually auto-fire in order for this to be at all useful, but... Let's get this going. And then just wait. And, okay, delayed their FTL thanks to the use of Ion Blast. And it looks like they have no shield penetrating weapons, which is good for me. I do not want to have to deal with shield penetration. And now it's just a matter of playing the waiting game in terms of this silly thing taking forever because I don't have any natural weapons since I'm playing on the Taurus. And we didn't die! They died horribly, we did not. We are alive for the moment. But only for the moment. Though really an uneventful start, all things considered. And, in the spirit of dying horribly, I shall attack indiscriminately on this drone. Thankfully it has no shield, so it should be fairly easy to get rid of. Just ion blast the weapons and can't really do anything. I, 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 well, it's not supposed to be able to do anything. So much for dealing with weapons. At any rate, there we go. Now the weapons are down. And now it's going to go down as well. So, for... Well, Sector 1, hard playthrough. No surprises, nothing really bad has happened. So it's not the most entertaining start, but hey, at least it is practical. Mm, I'll wait on this for now. Really what I want to do is get some combat weapons, so I've got to be careful about shops. And hey, thanks to the sensor station, we know it's nearby. Like a distress beacon. Oh, this one. I know what's going to happen here. Either it'll work or it'll fail horribly. And it works. Oh, right, I'm thinking that the one with the NG virus is the problem. That would be an issue. And we have enough scrap. I think we would have enough scrap for a weapon if we found a shop. But let's go potentially die horribly and probably kill something else. Hmm. I do not have need of his services. I shall avoid consolidating with him. I apologize for a sec, the chat is going weird. I'm not sure if it's 
Broken or... Okay, someone in the chat is going to be... We can't fight. Okay, there's someone in the chat who is putting up messages that I can't actually read. They are just... Basically ASCII characters 178 to 176. The sort of wall type characters you see. I don't know if Rushers is putting that up there because he wants to just type walls out, or if that's... Okay, he's just typing walls out. I thought he was having a bug. And... We may die horribly once again! So, Mon Cookie is going to be at least slightly vindicated in that we do have a fight. We may die horribly, and actually I want to... Well, stop the weapons, but... Stopping the engines is good as well. Stops... Oh! Yeah. Okay. Well, that's... Ion, I guess. Okay, I guess that achievement works regardless whether, regardless of whether you have the ions actually being your own. That is surprising. I didn't expect that to actually happen. That being said, this is working out surprisingly well for a hard playthrough. Sheesh! I would expect. I was expecting a hard playthrough. Is you know I would be dead by now, but I guess not. At any rate. Ah, there we go. My drone can continue to deal some damage. Although I've lost my cameras. Come on, Ions. No! We should kill you. Get more scrap that way. I need to find a way to kill the crew, come to think of it. That probably would be a good idea. If I can find a way to kill the crew, then I can actually take more scrap. Apparently that does help out. And finally, we kill the ship. And if I die and come back, I will go for the slightly more interesting option of the Kestrel, since that actually has proper weapons to start with. But there's a store here. We may get a store. She'll aid the civilian ship, possibly die, probably get more scrap. I think I've got lots of drone parts. 13 drone parts so far. I'm getting a lot of drone parts after every fight, too. And, oh, come on. No, they're ironing our shields. I guess actually... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Actually, no, repair the shields. That's the more important thing. The more pressing thing is shields. You need that repaired. In fact, why are... Oh, darn it. Always auto-fire weapons. That... That should be a matter of course, really. Oh, and oxygen's on fire. Okay, well that's not good. Ironically, the oxygen is on fire. I shall have to vent. And down goes the ship. As we vent our own. Hooray! More scrap! And now all we have to do is die horribly. Oh good, okay, the fire is gone. Equalize pr Oh crap. Well, equalize pressure, that at least gives the engine a bit more time to repair. Well, Don T, you may die honorably. And no you don't! You live! Okay. I need another crew member for the shields. And on to the store. Let's get some proper weapons. Oh, Monku is trying to do Ask Yard in the channel. That makes sense. In a weird, backwards sort of way that I really don't understand. And there's no weapons. Thanks, guys. Real great. However, there are more drones, and... Ooh. Oh, I just don't have quite enough for that. Repair drone, defense drone. Teleporter's kind of useless. Hmm. Don't drop the combat drone, even if it is an intruder drone. Okay, so... Boarding drone, likely not to be the best choice. Oh, never mind, Rush Source is not Mon Cookie. My mistake. That I was commenting on the Ask Garrett wasn't working as well as you'd like it to, because it really isn't. Probably depends on a specific... ...sizing of the chat, which I'm not doing right now. Regardless, back to the game itself, at hand! Oh, system repair drone might not be a bad idea. For as one power. Yeah, let's go for that. Why not? And everything else seems pretty reasonable, so I shall continue. Because now I have enough power to power those drones. We are good! And the auction is taking its sweet time to just set up. Okay. And I have not yet died horribly. Apparently Sector 2 or 3 is where dying horribly happens. We're gonna move on to Sector 2. And I should kill the ship since I am being... Well, as you can see, I am belligerent like that. 
He has Iron Blast for weapon, and that's about it. And I have my combat drone, and I'll get system repair up if running if I need to. For the meantime, I will not have enough power. Oh, shoot. I need to upgrade my reactor. That is the next step. Absolutely, next thing I must do is upgrade the reactor. Actually, probably want to ionize the shields, too, come to think of it. Yes, definitely want to ionize the shields. The timing is not working out. Oh, good, my shields just came up in time. Now ionize the weapons. And the shields continue to remain down. Ah, shields are not going to be ionized for long. Go, remove the shields, my ion cannon. There we go, that works. Shields get in the way. They wanted to be ionized. They didn't want to be in the fight anymore. They were done. They were tired. They wanted to go home. And I helped them. And down goes the ship. And more scrap. Okay, now I need more power. I think that's... Actually, if I get another bar of power, that means I can power engines and drones to full. Everything powered to full. Let's go into the next sector. And since I'm trying to die horribly, we shall go to the harder sector, the Mattis Control sector. Oh! Ditch the healing power. Okay, Monk is suggesting ditching the NG Medbay healing power. Fair enough, but that's not an option right now since I have exactly zero scrap. I guess I can get them fuel and... Hey, there we go! There's some scrap. Let's see what the store has. I probably should have jumped around the side and done that. That probably wasn't the best idea. Well, what, is this, what does this have? I shall listen to the chat. Sell that. And... Hmm. Ooh! Oh, that is nice. Reverse Ion Field. I'm not sure if that would be super useful, but I have encountered a lot of Ion. Hmm. Oh, whoops, he meant to ditch the power of healing, not the... Oh, shoot. Okay, never mind, I did that wrong. Oh well. Excuse me. Still, Reverse Ion Field probably is going to be useful since I have been getting hit a fair amount by that. That has not been fun. Okay, that will likely end in my destruction because the Rebel Fleet's probably going to meet up at that point. Shoot. Well, I think I can go around this way and that'll work okay. Yeah, I'll do that. I certainly don't need to power the medbane now. Aid the civilian ship. And wait, I don't need this rep up. Well, actually, I might. Let's see, I will want to get rid of their teleporter. Well, okay, it's too late for that now. Crap, human, you're the other one who has a chance. Go. Go, my slightly more than useless human at fighting. Oh, crap, you are useless at fighting. Get back, my useless human. I, I, no, oh, oh boy, that was too close. Oh, great. Of course, fire, it has to be fire. Or have system repair drone deal with that, wonderful. I guess it was good that I put that up, that's one thing, and hey, that mantis is. I just lost my, shoot, I just lost my other engine crew. Well, that's just great. That's just perfect. I... Okay, well, one of my crew died horribly. So it was partially successful. A crew member died horribly. Perfect. We're off to an ignominious start. An ignominious start. Auction now done. Go back to repair. At least I have a system repair drone that is definitely handy. And that was our weapons guy, too. Shoot. And he was a really good weapons guy, too. <sighs> oh, well. On to the previously determined path. Oh, and I get... Ooh, a boarding drone. Nice. I like that. Can I power my drone control? Ooh, I could. I could actually have board... Oh, I can't have boarding in combat. That would not work, apparently. Okay, well, I'll go to the next distress call and then figure that out. The horrible death is slowly creeping up. It's... Attack! Oh, crap. Oh, good, they don't have a teleporter. Oh, thank goodness. They do not have a teleporter. That makes my life much easier. Although... 
I could drop this in repair drone and go for the boarding drone instead. Try how that works. Although admittedly I can't see what's going on. That is a bit of a problem. Oh, I can! Ooh, nice! Ooh! All, okay, Mantis is trying to fight it. That's not going to work out so well, but everything else is going to work out okay. They don't have a med bay. That's definitely handy. And we are getting rid of possibly the NG crew. Well, okay, we are definitely damaging their crew. But they have no med bay, which is good. And now the combat drone to finish it off. Go, combat drone. Oh, that would have been useful before. Getting rid of the doors. That would have been handy. Ah, and I can fire off another boarding drone if I wanted to, but I don't have the power. Yeah, so this means I need to upgrade the system power, but I wanted to make sure I actually had the power to do that with. And... They were just about to die. Thankfully they had the teleporters. I went lucky there. No teleporters means an easy time for me. And I could probably... Oh, not quite. I don't have enough to do that. I just want to get to a store. I want to get to a store, see if I can use the scrap that I have to make it work. Oh, stunning the oxygen, of course. That would work. And there's no sign of... Oh, there's a store! Awesome, I do have a store available. I shall go buy things. I shall buy the store. And then the store shall tremble in terror as... Oh, they have a clone bay. Well, that's just perfect. All right, well... Can't choose the target for the boarding. Stunning the auction is not a bad idea, I agree. Although I am a little bit worried. I think one of these is a ion weapon, so I should be good. And they do have a teleporter, which means I am probably totally and completely screwed. I shall preemptively ditch most everything. I shall just... Yeah, let's just open everything but where I am right now. Vent preemptively. Oh, nice! And the boarding drone got into the oxygen! Perfect! And you forced them to walk through the oxygen. Although, admittedly, that does mean no planning. Aha! My ion resistance worked out! And even less oxygen is available. They are running out of oxygen. Their oxygen is stunned. Okay, I gotta get rid of their weapons, too. And now that Mintus goes to his probable death. Oh crap, that's not gonna work. Okay, it worked! Ah! It it's not actually failing. How about that? This Okay. Getting rid of the oxygen definitely was a winning move. Thank you for the suggestion. Did me much good. Now let's close up this and actually spread the oxygen around in a sensible fashion since I'm not gonna be bored anymore. Wow. I kind of wish I had upgraded my drone power stuff, because I can't actually deal damage outside of this boarding drone. But it looks like I am about to destroy their entire cr Oh no, come on! Uh, must they... Must they make my life difficult? I, must be an obligation of theirs. Ooh! What the heck did I just... Stun out? That... Oh, interesting. Everything apparently gets stunned up by the particular Ion Blast. Bizarre, but... Their entire crew is almost done! Ha! Teleported back. Oh, it must be more than just Ion. I gotta look at what that weapon is. I kinda wish you know what the weapon was. Oh, and the boarding drone? Is it about to kill all their crew? Oh, not quite. Okay, it's just going for the shields now. I yeah! I think that's everything! Did I kill all their crew? I believe I did! I believe we successfully managed to destroy absolutely everything that they had. Or almost. Not quite. Ah, shoot. Okay, we'll combat drone finish them off. It's apparently one oh right, cloning bay. Crap. Failed to notice that one. Teleporter's down though, that saves me time. Piling's down, there's no dodging left. The clone bay were to go down, that would have been that would have been perfect. But I can't control where they act where this boarding drone drops into, so that cloning bay <sighs> ruined my life. Completely forgot about that. Thankfully, timing it out properly, the teleporter's down. The cloning bay were down, I might send another boarding drone in, but I think it's not worth it. I don't think it's worth the drone part. We're about to win! We're not dying horribly once again. Just destroying everything they have. But hey. We did choke out their entire crew, and now to the store. There's one jump away from the exit, and I have 74 scrap. Okay. 
Ha! Weapons! Ooh, firebomb. Or mind control. No, I don't have money for that one. But I could get the firebomb. That is tempting. Huh. Takes two power. Okay, well, let's try that. Try a firebomb as a weapon. Oh! Sheesh, that has a massive charge time. I did not see that. I shall get some fuel. On to the next sector. Abandoned sector, huh? Let's go there. We're on sector three and I'm not yet died horribly. All things considered, I think this is a rousing success. I know how long this took to charge. Man, if I had weapon pre-igniter, that would be awesome with that firebomb. That'd be absolutely wonderful. Ooh. Lanius. Have not encountered these yet. New advanced edition thing. Oh! Perfect. At least I have no teleporters. Hmm. Huh. Let's fire off a boarding drone, see what happens. Go, my boarding drone! Our mom's gonna take a sweet time to charge up, but hey, it might just work. Ooh, what should I charge up? They are- I have hit the clone bay, at least. That's one good thing. Aha, firebomb in the shields. Start a fire in the shield. There's no art of weapons, I mean. Should reduce a lot of the threat to me. Oh, great. Thanks a lot. Damage my weapons. Just perfect. Oh, does it not destroy systems? Maybe it just only destroys crew. That was a mistake then. In that case. Oh crap, speaking of fire. Alright, let's just... Let's vent intelligently. Actually, let's close everything. Then vent into shields, because now I have no shields, which is just perfect. My weapons are slightly damaged too. And now I've scar- Okay, that was perfect timing. That was the only chance I had. Fire another boarding drone. This is the only hope I have. My all is not doing well. We may die horribly. Hooray! Horrible deaths for all. Oh wait, Atlantis don't require auction, do they? Somehow I suspect they don't. I have the sneaking suspicion that Atlantis don't actually require oxygen. Oh wait, I can turn. Oh no, I can't because the doors are broken. Well, that's just perfect. Fix them doors! You fix the doors and then pause this and then hope for the best. Okay. Open up the inside. This is where we die horribly, people. Yep! We died horribly! In Sector 3. Thanks to Alanius' ship. Okay, now let's go with the Kestrel since that's a bit more normal. And actually has stuff other than Ion. Yeah, okay, apparently Lanny's do not have oxygen needs. Yeah, I kind of noticed that when there was no oxygen in there to begin with. Poor choice. A poor choice indeed. And now we shall go. Actually, I'd be curious though, what did I... Wow, actually... Oh, I do have Layout B now. Interesting. Not that it really helps much since that's just one guy with a bunch of drones. However, I was going, going to go with the Kestrel, and so I shall. If you guys have any names for the ships, go ahead and suggest them. Because, hey, I don't really feel like thinking about them right now. And we shall go with the Kestrel, which is the more normal ship. We'll check. What do I have for equipment? No augmentations. That's what you see there is all I have. Distress call first. Though I'm fairly convinced I'm not going to die horribly in Sector 1. Despite all the risky behavior I did last time, I had no problems. Very surprising. And yeah, I guess sector one's pretty uneventful, even on hard. I shall be a hero because I am belligerent like that, as I'm sure you've all noticed. And first things first, drop the shields and then drop the drones. Actually, don't auto fire Artemis because I don't want to have that. Just auto fire lasers. 
Actually, drop the weapons. No, drop the drone. Never mind. Drop that drone hard. Because of that... Oh, that was too close. And even then I got my ship damaged. But hey, it's down. Shields are down. Drones are damaged. Get that weapon system down. Ah. And now you must die. You shall pay for your insolence, pirates. Because I'm just feeling in a bit of a bad mood right now, thanks to what you did. You've annoyed me. And you shall die. That's the price you pay for mildly annoying me. Oh, darn. Couldn't save their crew. Oh well. Got stuff. I got paid. And we have... Money. Mm, no. Oh! Oh, do I have anything to sell for that? Not really. No. 2% more scrap from any source. I... I don't want to drop that burst laser. I definitely want to drop the Artemis. But I gotta drop something if I want to get that. Or actually... Yeah, I gotta drop something if I want to get that. There's no other way I'm gonna get that this game. Unless it comes up in another place. Of course, that's always a possibility. Okay, given that missiles are expensive, I shall go for dropping this and then just have to kind of tough it out a bit for a little while. As the scrap cover arm ends up paying for itself, hopefully. <laughs> that's a bit of a risk. But hey, more money. Oh, perfect. Of course, weapons don't charge while it's doing that, which is just great. Oh, good, it only fires infrequently, apparently. Less frequently than my shields charge. Wonderful, and that's even without someone charging them for me. And this has no shield, so I don't need the Artemis. Now I just need to buy another missile launcher again. I can't actually buy back the one I hawked. Oh, oh that jerk. Just about done charging. Not that I did it any good. Might as well just get rid of the cloaking device to save myself time. Come on. Actually, wait. At this point, I'm going to kill it. There we go. Has died. And I barely got any scrap from there. But hey, I got data. Ah... Uh. Shoot. Okay, he's got shields. That's painful. I mean, I should be able to knock him out, but... Shields in a nebula. Thankfully, no teleporter against Mantis. Well, this is going to be... This is going to be boring, actually. Oh, maybe not. Never mind. We have impact. Damage their shields, but not enough. Oh, great. Ha! Now their shields are down. And their weapons should soon be down. Because their weapons are currently an insult to me. Really, I am not... I do not approve of this. They're attacking me is... Well, I'd say it's blasphemous, really. And they die. They pay for their insolence. Their scrap belongs to me and always has. I'm merely claiming what is rightfully mine. Once again, I continue to claim what is rightfully mine. And also push more power into engines, because I kind of need that. Dodging is my only hope right now. <laughs> I sort of have shields, that's about it. Oh no, no I don't. Or I sort of do, because that doesn't really matter so much, but let's just assume I have fire in the med bay. Oh no, I don't, never mind, I, I would know. Thankfully no fire so far, that's been merciful, if nothing else. Oh, that's just, just great. Just perfect. Uh, weapons are down. Now to get rid of the drone systems, because that drone system is not being kind to me. Repair the shields! Faster! Faster, you! That's not faster enough. Great. Uh, so much scrap. So much scrap wasted because of that. There we go. Now it's dead. 
And now I need things to repair. Go here, you go here, you go... Oh shit, everything's on fire! You guys go here. Put out the fires quickly. Before they kill you. Come on, before they kill you. Oh, no, never mind. Just repair the doors. Crap, get out of the- get out, get out! No! Darn it, no! Not you, not you! Why must everything burn? Why must everything be so flammable? Well, I don't think there's much hope. Come on, repair the doors! One guy! We aren't dead yet! Not as long as we have one... one person on board. Then we can just vent everything else out. Make everything else just go out for lack of oxygen. Still a time. It kinda sucks being in a nebula too, because it's I can't see what's going on. I just know that there's fire because of the reports here. And now the shields have burned. Oh no! Oh that's why. No, full vent. Vent everything. Especially since the doors are basically not How are they surviving this? Oh, right, because you actually, you superpower them, so they're blast doors. Nice! Thanks to Teldurin here, doors are blast doors and thus prevent fires. And the fires are gone! Now to re oxygen and... You know, open this up, but leave the doors as they are. Oh yeah, right, I could just turn off oxygen. Didn't have to vent that. Oh well. Now go on and actually deal with this. Fix the medbay, heal yourself up, and now you are sole crew member. You alone man this ship. Which means you must be in the pilot seat since there's no other way to actually get out of here otherwise. This is gonna suck. Well, I didn't call this let's die horribly for nothing. I say that much. Now for the shields. Yeah, sorry about this, it's actually taking a little while, but... While dying horribly is definitely what's going to happen, I figure I might as well fight tooth and nail to avoid doing exactly that, if possible. And hey, I've got free time to repair right now. As far as I know, the Rebel Fleet isn't actually coming in as I'm waiting. If they are, that would suck. That would be really terrible if they did, but hey. Here we go, shields are back online. Cameras are back online soon, not that anyone will notice, but hey, they're back online. And piloting will be the last to go, and then we can finally leave. Get out of this hellscape which has claimed two of the crew. Let's see what I can do with this. Well, this is kind of curious that... You could cycle through crew and not actually really change anything about the way things are playing out. So I'm thinking that the player character is actually a shipborne AI. Rather than any of the members of the crew. They're just they're just AI, that's all. Hmm. One guy, I think this might actually be prudent. And evade chance, that might also be prudent. Although it needs power to work. Thankfully it does not need to be manned to work, so you have a 20% evade chance. Nice. Hmm. Well, this might work. No store nearby, though. Ah! I could have bought a slave. Oh, he does have a teleporter. Good thing I got the blast doors. This is gonna get ugly. In fact, just in case, I'm gonna open up everything. Preemptively vent. There's no reason for oxygen to be in any part of the ship other than the cockpit. That is the only part of the ship oxygen needs to be. Everything else can suffocate for all I care. And, oh, it's a rock. Just perfect. Thankfully, I have blast doors. So that is somewhat useful, although I think I'm still going to die here. No. Oh. 
And no, oh, down it goes. We have died. It did not work. That scrap recovery arm was not worth it. Oh well.